Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al Sadani affirmed the government's support for all arts, while indicating that Iraq is on the right path. This came during al Sadani's reception this afternoon with a group of Iraqi plastic artists and sculptors on the occasion of Eid al Adha, according to a statement received by Mawazine News Agency. al Sadani offered congratulations to those present on the occasion of the blessed Eid, stressing that art has historically flourished in Iraq since ancient civilizations and the cultural connection of plastic art has not been cut off in subsequent eras, which was embodied in the important drawings left by the Iraqi artist. He explained that Iraqi plastic art is an Arab pioneer, and this size and artistic cultural weight makes the task of plastic artists and sculptors double. Because they are the heirs of all the creators of civilizations in this land, pointing to the necessity of establishing a museum for Iraqi plastic art in Baghdad. He also stressed that Iraq went through stages in which the treasures of contemporary Iraqi art were looted, and we have worked to restore many of them. He pointed to the government's interest in culture and arts in general, and allocated for the first time more than $13 billion for various types of arts, stressing the importance of holding conferences and cultural activities, due to the cultural sector's need for them and in order to introduce the reality of Iraq, and the government will take care of them, and His Excellency stated that, at the request of the university president Arabic, the Iraqi pavilion at the Arab League was awarded 15 paintings by Iraqi artists. The prime minister explained, Iraq is on the right path at all levels, and the national service government has a clear image based on a thoughtful government program that represents an essential step for building confidence between the political system and the people. al Sadani confirmed, during the meeting, his approval of a set of proposals presented by the delegation of plastic artists. And artists, concerned with the interest in fine art and its support by ministries and government institutions, and promised to form a committee to follow up on the requirements of the proposals and work to implement them.